All right, very good. Thank you, Sam. Well, if your weight loss has plateaued and you're not seeing any results, your workout may be to blame. The key is to boost your metabolism, and today we are going to show you how. And joining us this morning is fitness expert Lisa Lynn. She knows Thanks everything for having me. about fitness. Thank you. All right, so the first thing, we should be focusing on boosting our metabolism. You've spoken about this before on the show. Remind people of the ways we need to do that. Well, you know, 90% of what we do is, is caused by what we eat. So I'm getting buckets of emails. People are spending hours in the gym. They're getting injured up the wazoo, but it's like they're heading in the wrong direction. There are specific ways you can boost your metabolism, and believe it or not, it's easier than you think. Much easier. And so basically there are metabolic boosting workouts and exercises totally. you should be doing. And they're specific. So if you're going to the gym and you're not losing that pound a day, number one, clean up your diet. You know, we know how we have to do that. Number yes. two, you do have to work out three days a week, metabolic boosting style workouts, 30 minutes, done home, no machines, with these babies. With those. Now, before we get to these, because you are putting me to work. Yeah, I'm going to work and I hard. Thought those dumbbells we won't be able to talk You gave me the bigger dumbbells this morning. Um, yes. What is uh, the metabolic workout doing in your body differently than Very what a normal workout would be? So instead of doing one bicep curl, stop, take a break. Like I watch people, they rest for three minutes in between sets. We're going to take three moves of big body parts, or three big body parts, and combine them into one move. So it's not that you do less, it's multitasking at its finest. And that revs the metabolism, especially if you didn't eat wrong before you went in the gym. Right, and these are all things people can do right in their own oh, home. Oh, by the way, I have a workout in the book. Almost all of our viewers have one at this point. I have a DVD. I have an app. I have these online on YouTube. There's no excuses. Exactly. Guides Pick people through the process. All right, and speaking <laughs> of picking dumbbells. things up, I'm going to get my yeah, dumbbells. Yeah, I'm going to show you some love today on Valentine's right, with a nice see. workout. Let's see how so I move do. move one, and you're going deep with or without short. So make believe you have a chair behind here, and okay. you're sticking your butt out, and you're going to raise the dumbbells like up. Like this? Yes, yeah, so you're doing a nice what we call squat thrust where you're up and down like a little piston for 12 repetitions. A little piston? Yeah, so I'm having people train a little faster. The super slow, great move, not for metabolisms, we're boosting. And this and is working out the whole heels. body right oh, yeah. now, not just one thing like and you said before. I gave you two dumbbells versus a kettlebell for a really good reason. In order to do this, you're buffing up your upper body, you're shaping it, not bulking, and you're working your abs. Which is a key area people yeah, always we want to work. All, right? Exactly, we want it all. All right, so, what's the next one? Next one, you're sitting in your heel and you're going to step back while you kick back with a dumbbell like this. I have no coordination. So, yes, wait, so I'm like we'll this. We'll just do the right leg then. We'll go easy on you. And by like the way, this? you can modify your moves. Yes, sir. And keep all your weight back here and drive that back. You can go further. Come on, go deep. Going deep. And when you kick back with that dumbbell, what I find with these women whose arms are not as tight as they want, they don't, they're not felt in the neck as much when you do a slam back like this and you're functioning and you will get out of breath, as you say. Exactly. It's not as easy as it looks, that move. No, it isn't. But move I have three. heavy dumbbells here, too. Yeah, so, 15. all right. <laughs> so, move next one is you're going, never allowing that knee to go over your toe. You're lunging deep. The deeper the move, the more calories you burn. And you're going to do a bicep curl. Just like this. Very good, yep. And, and put your elbow right in here and let that dumbbell go all the way to the ground. So two things, outer thigh, inner thigh, glutes, stomach, and the bicep all at once. And so maybe you don't get out of breath. Like this is intervals done with weights technically. Right. Get the other side, we don't want you to be crooked. But you can feel the, the burn on the entire body. In fact, and of all the workouts I've ever too. done, it is. This is the most effective if you're looking to transform your body. Right. If you're looking for bulk, you can still do it. You're just going to want to use heavier weights, slow it up. So guys, girls, husbands, wives, kids, there's nobody that shouldn't be doing these. Exactly. And how often should we be doing this? Remind people. Three days a week. And, and you should be working the whole body three days a week. Everybody should be doing this. But here's some good news. A lot of people are shoveling right now. They're hurting. Yes. If you do one workout, you don't go backward. You stay planted where you are. So... Do it in your clothes, make it work. Forget the gym. They're closed. It's snowing. You could do it right Get at the, the house. dumbbells. All right. And then, real quick, we have 30 seconds left, and I'm out of breath. Look what you've done yeah. to me. <laughs> me too. You know, when we're doing this, people want to see results. How quickly, if someone stays to this routine, will they start noticing this is working? Very good question. With the right workout program and diet to match within the same week. All right, very good. How nice is that? You're always a wealth of knowledge. Thanks for having me. Thank you so much. I'm out of breath. That's my workout <laughs> for the day.
<laughs> For more information, you can go to our website, WTNH.com. Click the Honor tab and pull down to the Good Morning Connecticut Weekend section. We'll have more information there for you.